the five richest people on Earth more than doubled their wealth since 2020, totaling $869 billion, according to Oxfam's report. The surge in wealth contrasts starkly with nearly 5 billion people globally becoming poorer due to inflation, war, and the climate crisis. Oxfam predicts the possibility of the world's first trillionaire in a decade if current trends in wealth accumulation persist. The report is released in conjunction with the annual World Economic Forum meeting in Davos, Switzerland, attended by wealthy individuals and world leaders. Nabil Ahmed from Oxfam notes that, despite growing inequality, there are positive signs, with workers and some governments pushing for better rights and conditions. The current situation is described as a new gilded age, but efforts from workers, regulators, unions, and communities are beginning to challenge it. Elon Musk emerged as the biggest winner, with his wealth soaring to $245.5 billion, a 737% increase since March 2020. Bernard Arnault, chairman of LVMH, and his family's net worth rose by 111%, reaching $191.3 billion. Jeff Bezos' fortune increased by 24%, totaling $167.4 billion, while Larry Ellison's wealth reached $145.5 billion, up by 107%. Warren Buffett's net worth rose 48%, reaching $119.2 billion, completing the list of the top five wealthiest individuals. Overall, billionaires globally have seen their wealth grow by $3.3 trillion, outpacing inflation by three times since 2020. U.S. billionaires, largely from equity in their companies, became $1.6 trillion richer during this period. Oxfam's report highlights that seven out of ten of the world's largest public companies have a billionaire CEO or principal shareholder. The top 1% globally holds 43% of financial assets, with variations like 32% in the U.S., 50% in Asia, 48% in the Middle East, and 47% in Europe. Oxfam points out that 148 major corporations made nearly $1.8 trillion in profits in the year leading up to June 2023, 52.5% higher than the average from 2018 to 2021. The report criticizes industries like oil and gas, pharmaceuticals, and finance for recording higher profits recently compared to previous years. Nabil Ahmed emphasizes the peril of ignoring the role of monopoly power in wealth redistribution to the top. Oxfam calls for government intervention, urging measures to break up monopolies, empower workers, tax corporate profits, and invest in public goods and services. Amitabh Behar, Oxfam International's interim executive director, emphasizes the need for public power to counter corporate control and inequality. In summary, Oxfam advocates for governments to intervene and shape fairer markets, challenging runaway corporate power and promoting equality.